In this tech tip, we will look at how you can create virtual components in your assemblies without having to save a file to disk. Typical uses will be for adding miscellaneous items to your bomb, such as paint or grease. For this example, I'll add a paint item to this assembly and the related drawing bomb. To add a virtual component to an assembly document, select New Parts from the Assemble toolbar. A new virtual component will be added to the assembly tree. Virtual component names are displayed with square brackets. I'll left click in the graphics area to accept the component and it will be located at the assembly origin as a fixed component. So that the component has some meaning in the bomb, I'll rename the part and call it paint. Now I'll save the assembly. SOLIDWORKS will inform you that there is a virtual component in the assembly and will require you to save it internally in the assembly or as a physical part on disk. I want the component to remain virtual so I'll choose save internally and pick OK. Note that the file can only be found in the assembly. There is no part file on disk which will help to reduce file clutter. Now I'll switch to the related drawing and you can see the paint item has been added to the bomb. If you want to add a description to the part, go ahead and type in the bomb cell. The property value will be saved to the virtual component. If you want to assign other custom properties to the part, then you can return to the assembly and open the virtual file. Then assign property values as normal. If you want to create a physical part file to use in other assemblies, then return to the assembly and right click on the component. Select Save Part and External File from the shortcut menu. Select the part in the dialog and pick either Same as Assembly for the same file location as the assembly file or specify a path. I'll pick Same as Assembly and OK. The part will now be created on disk. So, as you can see, virtual components are a great way of creating bulk or miscellaneous items for your assemblies.